find on a local beach. The carcass of a large hammerhead shark buried along that Jupiter beach. How long has it been there and who's responsible? News Channel 5's John Shainman is live from Jupiter as one shark expert is trying to answer those questions. John? Michael and Kelly, the hammerhead shark that was discovered here this morning. In fact, right behind me, you might be able to see a couple of flies buzzing around. You can't see it right now, but a little while ago, well, you could certainly smell it. Now, shark advocates believe it is not the only shark that's buried along our local beaches right now. Local shark expert says he's going to be out looking for other carcasses this week. FWC agents earlier this afternoon reburied this hammerhead that was found earlier today. We don't quite know who found the buried shark, but here's what we do know. It's believed it was caught in a weekend catch and release tournament along the coast. Now, because of the rough seas at the time, the decision was made just to bury the shark along the beach and remove it at a later date. What we're doing is we're attracting these large predators to where our families swim. Is that a good idea for public tourism for, for our beaches? Would you like to take your family swimming there? Now, the catch and release tournaments are legal in this area. Shark advocates, though, believe they have an impact on sending sharks closer to the shoreline. We're live at Jupiter, John Shane, WPTV, News Channel 5.